Hey guys, today I have Volkswagen Polo Classic as a project. I said I'm not gonna mess up with uh, other people's cars anymore, but sometimes I have to make an exception and help out if I can, of course. But in this case, why I'm making this video, I'm not gonna show you how I fix this car because it is pretty straightforward and simple task. I don't wanna waste time with this thing but I want to show you what I have found as a problem this car is been for repairs recently and from what I understand it is been done something on the exhaust pipe I don't know if it is replaced or anything I am not sure but what I know for sure is that the guys in the shop had been asked to check the car because the owner decided to make a trip it doesn't live here where I am and they decided to come to visit and stuff and it is pretty far away from where they live so they decided that it's gonna be a good idea to ask the shop to check out the car if it is okay for them to make a trip with it and they said yes the car is perfectly fine you can travel as much as you like but the moment they arrived the car was damaged and what was the problem they initially thought that there is something it was knocking sound in the back and they decided that probably it is something uh, with the um, exhaust because the last thing that was done on the car was the exhaust and probably something has moved or shift or whatever but you can see that the exhaust it's not in its best condition anyway but in this case when I took the car for a short spin just to figure out what is that noise and where is it coming from I quickly realized that it is from the shock absorber not the exhaust and you can see that the spring is disattached from the shock absorber there should be one whole thing and over here I don't know if you can tell but over here it should be one big metal piece that is connecting pressing down the spring into place and connecting the shock absorber with the spring and in my case this metal plate is missing what i found was only this piece when i disassembled the shock absorber there is only this little piece left of it and probably you can tell by the condition of it that that metal plate was rusted so badly that she just disappeared i think over here you can see the two small rusted pieces i found them on top of the spring in this little rubber compartments the two pieces were over here so yeah it is um, very interesting how can this rust so badly that the spring will pop up out of its place fortunately nothing serious happened the problem was caught immediately they didn't drop the car anymore so I'm gonna try to figure out the solution I have ordered new piece for over here this mount this metal thing that is supposed to connect them and we'll see if I will have the luck to fix the car but I just wanted to show you what happens sometimes with the older cars they rust in places that can't believe honestly that this is gonna rust so badly that this is gonna just disappear the whole thing and it is gonna break this way so well guys at the end of the video I at least can show you what is the new part looking like and what I have disassembled you can see the spring is over here the shock absorber is disassembled fully disassembled this time it's not uh, like it was from the car when I started the video but as I mentioned this is the new part and this is what I took off the car this piece and this piece this was all that was left from this thing this is the way this it's supposed to be it should look like this and 
it is mounted over here on top of the shock absorber like this and it holds the spring in place but in this case this is the first time that I'm seeing this I've seen these things crack or have some rust and small holes or something but I have never seen this spring seat to be rusted so badly that only this to be left of it it is just insane so yeah I'm gonna quickly assemble everything back and this is gonna be all for this video as I mentioned I didn't resist the urge to show you this part because probably it is gonna be difficult to imagine how this is supposed to be looking like when I'm showing you only this piece these bits of anything honestly so thank you so much again for watching and hope to see you in my next videos bye for now